All right, all right. Hey, how you doing? Ryan J here. Welcome back to day five of the Let's Make Some Money at Home right now training, challenge, info, whatever you want to call it. All right. Um, let's do a quick recap and I'll let you know what's in store today. Ooh, I'll just tell you what's in store today because I like this. Today is the bacon and guacamole. Bacon and guacamole. Why bacon and guacamole? Well, if you're having chips and salsa, which are delicious, guacamole makes it taste better. Why is it bacon? Because, let's face it, bacon on anything makes it so much better. Your pizza, which is good already, Throw some bacon on it. Oh, 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 now we're talking. Uh, a hamburger at your favorite hamburger joint with bacon on it and extra bacon. Mm. Pineapples. Well, wait a second. We're going too far. Okay. Anyhow, today is guacamole and bacon. Let's recap what we talked about for the first uh, four of these. All right. Day number one, we talked about mindset. Mindset, how you're thinking about it. And situationally, whether it's uh, you don't like what you're currently doing or as a situation or another situation where you could be is because of your job market or whether it's shut down or when you're going back to work or the hours being cut. That's a situation. Both are two different situations and we talked about how you think about it. All right. That was day number one. Day number two, I went through a whole list of things of what to do, what you can be doing and putting into action right now to start making money from home. Uh, day number three, I gave you the secret sauce, gave you the secret sauce, and that is literally fundamental for a whole bunch of things. So catch the secret sauce episode and then how to do it and how to go about it and putting forth like strategies on how. Uh, yesterday in the fourth one, we met Sam, my good buddy Sam, and for those just catching up, you know, um, of paramount importance, Sam, you will become married to him. Or Samantha or her. You're going to become married to Sam. And what Sam is, is sales and marketing. All right. So that's the recap. Let's get into it. Uh, I really like this. I got, I'm, I'm biased, I'm biased, and we're going to get into it. Out of all the things that I listed on day number two, uh, one of my favorite to talk about when it comes to being able to establish a business with pretty much no creativity, uh, you're not designing anything, is network marketing. I'm a fan of network marketing. I'm a network marketer myself, so call it biased, but I'm a firm believer in network marketing. And here's why. Because it's a simple, well, it's an easy way for the everyday average person to get into business for themselves with low overhead, low overhead, with systems already in place and to give it a go and to cut your teeth at seeing if you're an entrepreneur. It's the easiest, most simple way. Now, um, yeah, versus a brick and mortar business. Versus a brick and mortar business. Okay, so let's brick and mortar. What's that? All right, you want a Domino's franchise? All right, um, that's two hundred and fifty thousand dollars 
and uh, they want that liquid by the way 250k large liquid pay it plus i think you have to be 1 to 1.5 million liquid to be qualified for a Domino's franchise. And they're gonna tell you that in 10 years, you're gonna make your money back, okay? Start it, and you're a business owner and you're making pizzas. So you're gonna, it's gonna take 10 years and it's on the agreement, it's gonna take 10 years for you to get your 250 large back. All right, cool, whatever, that's, that's fine. To start your average network marketing business, is like on the high end a thousand dollars a thousand bucks and that's probably getting the primo package so you have the same tax benefits you're a business owner you're you're running a business now how you think of it in your mind like oh i only spent a thousand dollars on this i can't be a business owner no you are, you are, you're as serious as you take it. Like, would you take 250K large to own a brick and mortar Domino's? Serious? Yeah, you would. Would you take a thousand dollars investment in yourself to own and operate your own home-based business as serious? You may, you may not because it only costs you a thousand bucks. So the everyday average person can bust their, bust their chops and have the same tax benefits in network marketing and owning a legit business just the same as a Domino's franchise. All right, um, so that's one way because of the low overhead and ease of entry, the ease of entry. Anybody can do that. Here's another benefit. You don't have to create anything. You don't have to come up with the fancy idea of your widget or your product or anything like that. It's already created for you. So that takes the creative energy out of it for you. It's a no-brainer and there's hundreds and hundreds of network marketing companies out there so and there's a network marketing company for every niche so like whatever your interest is I'm pretty sure there's a network marketing company that caters to that niche and if it vibes with you and you enjoy the product or service well call that your home trying to reconnect I must have kicked the cord all right so with that being said all right uh, there are financial service network marketing companies financial services does not resonate with me so I would not align myself with that me I like health and wellness and being healthy that resonates with me so Without giving a company name, I'm in health and wellness because I jive on that. You know, it's of interest to me and it's easier to promote and market and love on it if you jive with it and if you believe in it. For me to try and promote, market and promote and sales and marketing, meeting Sam, a financial services business, I could probably do it, but then it just seems like work, work, work. So, <clears throat> oh, what was I talking about? I was talking about you don't have to create anything because the company already created it. Um, here's another thing that's good about it. You don't have to worry about the logistics of it all. You don't have to have a warehouse full of inventory. You don't have to build a website. The website's already built for you. You don't have to hire employees to make said product. The company already does that. You don't have to fill your garage with product. The company takes care of 
distribution to your customers. So it's already like a business in a box. Oh, I wish I had a box around here. Business in a box shows up on your doorstep, just like how your customers are gonna get theirs. It literally shows up on your doorstep. You open it up and here's all the stuff and bada bing, you're in business like that. You're, it's like that, that super fast. All the systems are in place, all the logistics are in place. You don't have to hire employees. Like when I say hire employees, I mean hire people to make said product and have a warehouse and a production line. You don't have to have any of that. That means you're not paying social security on them. You're not paying their payroll and all that kind of stuff. Now, here's a, here's a slick little trick that is 100% legal if you have a home-based business. Now, me, I put my daughter on payroll. She helps me out. I put her on payroll. She's under 18. I can write off that wage on my taxes. Huh, bonus. So, yeah, you can hire people, but there's tax benefits in it if you decide to do so. All right, so that's the logistics side. And, yeah, you're not putting in all that time and energy and worrying about if people have to show up to make your stuff. You don't have to worry about research and development. It's done for you. It's a done for system. It's kind of like, remember Chia Pets? Let's put, let's compare network marketing business model. It's done for you and a Chia Pet. You get the thing and you just add water and it grows, okay? Well, over here in the network marketing side, all you have to do is add your effort and your work into it and it grows. Everything you need is right here, just like the, the uh, Chia Pet with the, the hair, or maybe you got the sheep or whatever. You add the water and the sheep and it grows. Over here, all you do, add your effort, a little bit of time, and work on it, and it grows. Same thing. Um, here's, a, here's another benefit of As I See Network Marketing. Not only do you get your business in a box, but it comes with a support system. It comes with a support system. And what do I mean by that? Well, you're going to have somebody by your side teaching you what to do. Maybe you're a brand new guy in business and know nothing about business. All right, you will have a mentor that kind of comes with the project or your business that will coach and teach and train you along the way. Coach, teach, and train you along the way and show you how it's done. Um, with the SAM, the sales and marketing, um, how your business works, how to use the website, how and answer all, all your how-to questions. Why is he going to do that? Because, uh, well, it's of benefit to him and he or she is going to be one of your biggest cheerleaders. All right. So it comes with training involved. So a brand new person can enter in to network marketing and very rapidly with the learning curve rather than taking it years and years and years and years and years to figure out business can quickly and easily adapt that learning curve because the systems, the coaching, the training is all included and that's a super huge benefit. Um... Oh, this one, this one's awesome. This one's awesome. And this is literally uh, probably one of the best. Your association levels up immediately. So if, 
So what do I mean by that? All right. Well, what if you hang around, hang out with um, all your friends that uh, have the same ambitions and never seem to grow? Like the conversation you had with your buddy two years ago is still the same conversation that you're having today. And it's kind of stagnant. But you being a hustler and motivated and you're watching this video because you want more for your life you want um to make a difference or make an impact whether it's just for yourself or your neighbors community and world depending on how big your goal is and please set outrageous goals that fires you up for more motivation to like put the pedal to the metal and get busy and work all right if you're not hanging out with those type of people that strive you to do better or somebody you would like to emul emulate, um, association is where that all happens. The people you hang out with, well, you're probably going to turn into those people. If you upgrade your association and like, let's say you're hanging out with seven millionaires and you hang out with them, well, guess what? Just because of the water and the Kool-Aid you're drinking and your more um, positive association with them, kind of going to have to say you're going to be the eighth millionaire in that because your mindset switches, you begin to think that way and emulate their habits. So the power of association is awesome. Awesome. There's always been a reason why your parents back in the day said, don't play with that kid down, the, down there at the end of the block. He's bad news. Your parents knew the power of association well before you did. Or maybe you were that kid at the end of the block where other parents were telling their kids don't play with him anyhow but you get the point of the association being powerful you can immediately change your association like that for and here's how because the company you sign up with is probably going to have private facebook pages where they're going to answer questions cheer each other on uh give each other awards accolades and pat you on the back and be a positive, comforting, welcome community. That's been my experience with it. So just even if even if you just want the tax bennies and even if you just want to improve your situation and your association, <clears throat> it's a no brainer. It's right there. You get the tax bennies. And then all of a sudden, you make new friends and uh, your association is better. Bonus. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's a lot of whys and reasons why. How? How are you going to find out what's right for you? Which company you want to go with? How are you going to find that? Well... Lo and behold, you probably have some friends and family that are in network marketing currently. And you might not even know it. They might be secret, secret agent network marketers. You never know. So, um, reach out to a couple of them and ask them, ask them, like if you ever have had one of your friends or families uh, ask you um, about Pampered Chef or uh, Nordic Wear or, hey, you want to try this skin cream? Good chance that that was a network marketing company that they're with. All right. Um, how else would you go about it? Well, let's go back to what would interest you. All right. Me? I love to cook, but I don't know if I would necessarily be in Pampered Chef because, 
well, that just doesn't jive with me. So pick a company that you jive with, that you enjoy the products, um, and it's going to be super simple and super easy for you to be able to sell that because you're a believer in it already. That's another, that's just my advice as to how to figure out what company is right for you. Another, another thing, and this is going to be kind of important, is when it comes to picking your company, make sure whoever you sign up with, um, and this is just my two cents, that you jive with them personally. You know, that you get, uh, you get along that you see eye to eye and you have a good relationship and you can see yourself working with that person in the next couple of years. You know, so somebody you would agree with. So what do I mean by that? All right, if you're watching this right now and you agree with things that I say and you could see yourself working with me, that's what I'm talking about. You know, bonding and having the same vibe and wave wavelength because you honestly will be working together maybe not maybe not hand in hand physically but through phone calls zoom meetings uh reaching out via text and you might even win some vacations together so get along be cool to each other oh and if you think i'm cool reach out to me I'd love you on my team. Um, yeah, that about that about wraps it up for the nuts and bolts of this network marketing. Okay, so to recap and tell you what I told you, the easiest way for the everyday average person to start their own business for probably less than a thousand bucks. Companies will vary. Company prices will vary, of course. The easiest way, uh, because it's literally a business in a box. You get the tax benefits, you're gonna get an amazing association, and all you have to do is, like the Chia Pet of adding water, all you're doing is adding effort and working on it. Um, your association is going to be awesome. And, ooh, here's another thing. You might, you're probably going to take the deep dive into personal development. So developing, developing your sales and marketing skills. Developing your coaching, teaching, and training ability. Developing how you interact with people. Not a not a bad thing. Not a bad thing, that personal development. All right. I hope this was a help to you. Um, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yes, I will have another video. And this is going to be bonus. Bonus. So I'll do a recap of all five days. And I'll throw in some new nuggets for you. So look for that tomorrow. That will be day number six bonus training. Thank you very much for liking this and watching. Uh, go ahead and share this with anybody that you believe could use this type of information, and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Stay safe, stay healthy, and make it an epic evening.